I'd like to welcome all of you that are joining us online. Thank you for tuning in to us, with us here, to joining our worship service. We really appreciate all of you that take the time in your home, wherever you're at, to join into our worship. So welcome, and we hope that today you enjoy this worship service and that you are blessed through our whole service. We ask you to to join us in our garden of prayer. You know, I was thinking that sometimes uh, uh, we may be able to hear some of your testimonies. You know, just write in a short testimony that you would like to give during our garden of prayer. You can do that too, okay? And we'll read it here and be able to enjoy also the things that God has been doing in your life. So if you're with us today and... um, during our garden of prayer, you have a testimony to share. I'd like for you to do that. You know, just something you can type in uh, short. That way we can just read it here and also enjoy that just as we enjoy the blessings that we all receive and we share with each other here. We hope you enjoy our service today. It's a beautiful Sabbath. It's a good time to be able to come and worship God today. So we thank you ahead of time. May God bless us all today. Let us uh, erase anything negative that we have in our minds right now. You know, you're not going to fix it. If it's something you're not going to fix between now and one o'clock today, let it go. Don't worry about it. And just enjoy this moment that we're going to have right here. Let us bow our heads for prayer and let us begin our service this morning. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you so much for your blessings. Thank you for giving us the opportunity to be here today and to worship you and to just be able to to spend time with you here today, not only with you, but with each other, Lord, that we every day may come closer to each other and at the same time closer to you. Bless us today and may we experience your presence in a great way. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. Praise the Lord, church. Praise the Lord, church. Do we have any worshipers in the house this morning? any worshipers in the house this morning are we here to praise the lord this morning yes hallelujah we're about to praise the lord because we serve an awesome god because we serve an amazing god because we serve a god that changes water into wine like what is that (laughs) i don't know a machine yet that can do that but guess what our god can do that hallelujah okay technical difficulties but that's all right because God can amen all right so we're just gonna get through this hallelujah hallelujah let's put our hands together for God
you say? Amen. No? Yes. Oh, well, for me, <laughs> apparently not for y'all, but for me, um, I serve a great God. I serve a really great God, an amazing God, an awesome God. <laughs> and, you know, one of the things that I struggle with sometimes is that I want to testify to the world that he's great, but... <laughs> The world is not so accepting and you know we live in a world where everyone's just so sensitive <laughs> and everyone has their own worldview blah 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 um, but it's still in me to try to do that I'm a work in progress we're all a work in progress uh, yesterday I told you all I was in the airport for 11 and a half hours and I'm sitting there and I was telling the girls that it was actually interesting. We were just all talking. I was just making friends with everyone. And everybody knew my story. I knew everybody else's story. And they knew that I most likely would not get on this plane. And they were like, you know, our thoughts are with you. Our thoughts are with you. We want you to get on this plane. And I was like, well, thank you, guys. That's really nice. Um, but I'm going to pray. 
And, you know, I was really proud of myself at that moment because, you know, it was like 50 people there and we're all just talking and they all knew that I was going to pray while they were all thinking about great thoughts. Uh, so we're all a work in progress. So let us just take some time to just sing of the love of God, you know, talk to God about his, his goodness, his mercy, his awesomeness. We just want to sing of your love, Lord, and sing of your mercy.
so we hear a phrase that says, you know, give me my roses while I'm still alive, right? Don't wait till I'm dead. And as the song said, we're singing of the praises and mercies of God. We want to tell the whole world there's no need to wait on that. There's no need to wait till the end, till you're on your deathbed or till things are so dire to give God the praise, to recognize him as the king of glory. Amen. So this morning we're going to sing hallelujah until he comes again. We're going to sing hallelujah until Jesus is coming again because we don't need to wait. He is, he was, he is, and he'll forever be the king of glory. Amen. He deserves our praise. He deserves our worship. So let's praise him now, wherever you are, whatever is bothering you, whatever is binding you, let it loose and just lift up your praise.